a uh, very good morning from Migori County at our tree nurseries joint hands green life trees uh, perhaps what you guys didn't know is that we have green life trees and we have joint hands trees and green life is joint hands trees are working together to ensure that we increase tree cover to we increase tree population not only in migori county but as well as across kenya and so today i want to show you one of our other tree nurseries uh, that uh, we are running so in particular this is what we have we have got k apples here and as you check around we have planted uh, bamboo here and we also have some beautiful flowers beautiful plants that we are raising here and uh, so just wanted you to see all that we have lined up here in terms of tree seedlings that we are raising uh, it is a whole lot of work most of our colleagues are not at work today except for uh, one of us is called Zephania. Uh, as you can see him there, he can wave at you people. Yeah, he's so busy trying to attend to the plants that we have here. It is noisy a bit because the tree nursery is located at the roadside. Yeah, it is located at the roadside, so vehicles keep passing by and that is the noise that you people can hear. And here we have, this is called whistling pine, and this here is a whole line of cypress trees. Then we've got gravelia tree seedlings, and we've got uh, also uh, whistling pine among the very many trees that we are trying to raise here. We have got eucalyptus, and this in particular is animal fodder uh, used to feed livestock. Uh, this is called uh, this is called uh, Kaliandra and we've got uh, this is called commonly called Nandi flame and uh, we've got Podo tree and we've got the Delonyx regia. Delonyx regia is mostly called flamboyant and also Terminalia catapa that is an umbrella tree. Uh, so these are among the many tree seedlings that we have at our site, the many tree seedlings that we are raising. And uh, there's this other wing that I've not showed you, uh, where we are raising pine trees. These are pine tree seedlings. And we've got uh, this tree here. Uh, it's commonly in Africa, we call it mvule. I don't know how... Uh, people call it elsewhere, but scientifically we call it uh, Militia excelsa is one of the timber trees that are indigenous to Africa and This here is jackfruit tree seedlings and then uh, We've got uh, quite a number of indigenous trees that we are raising here including ornamental plants so this plant here is an ornament and usually so beautiful usually so lovely uh, all this is in our effort to try and increase tree cover for our county Migori county number 44 that is to the uh, is to the western southwestern parts of uh, of Kenya and uh, we are based uh, we are based next to Lake Victoria so uh, there's usually a lot of watering to ensure that these plants stand. This here has fallen down. I'll pick it and ensure that it stands again. Uh, our tree seedlings, we love them. We just love them so much. I and Pamela, this is the kind of life we live every day, trying to monitor how tree seedlings are growing. We have got many many of them we've got them in thousands in tens of thousands actually in hundreds of thousands like this in particular is called makamia tree and we've got a whole line of it then this here is acacia we've got a whole line of acacia tree seedlings 
and we've got palm trees we are raising palm trees as well uh, and all this work is taking place at the banks of a river we're doing all this at the banks of river Migori but importantly I would love that you get to understand how we are raising this is called podo tree we've raised them in large quantities and uh, we are anticipating that uh, the long rains will be hitting anytime soon so when the long rains come uh, most of these trees will have to be planted we are raising them in cement bags some of the bags are a little torn out like you can see this one here is so torn out so worn out but the tree seedling is still alive this is an extinct indigenous tree uh, called Wabugia ugandensis and uh, it is among the indigenous tree seedlings that we are raising here look here we've got uh, Elgon teak and uh, besides Elgon teak we have got podo tree and besides podo tree we've got just uh, so many these are uh, royal palm trees they are still young but we've got uh, some that are growing uh, a little big this is king alexander palm tree and so they are growing here now we are not only raising tree seedlings but we are also in effort to see that the seedlings that we raise are planted and ultimately they become trees years before we started this work this is uh, the banks of River Migori and that bridge over there is uh, called Sayote Bridge. So uh, this river here is useful to the community uh, because uh, mostly community members come over here and they wash uh, clothes and they use the river for several roles. So as you can see, uh, one community member has already uh, done her laundry and she's on her way home but the river is right here and uh, we've got uh, we've got community members using the river to do laundry to wash clothes and such other uh, stuff these trees used not to be here uh, this is an acacia tree this I planted by myself I planted this by myself uh, as a means of seeing that uh, we raise, uh, we try to protect this river bank. Almost 80% uh, of the trees that you see here are trees that I planted by myself. Uh, this in particular is a cotton tree called Bombax Saber. This tree was planted by a teacher who is a friend of mine and uh, that was about two years ago. Today it is um, about four meters tall. This acacia tree was planted by one of the guests who visited us here and it is also about three years old, already so tall. Uh, this is exactly the kind of work that we are doing. And in order to conserve this river, we've planted bamboo along the riverbank and not only bamboo we've just ensured that this section is a whole forest uh, so that this forest here uh, helps to contain erosion because uh, there is this gully this is a, a very deep gully uh, uh, that was eroded and all this, these tons of soil went into the river and ultimately you know this river this river Migori River Migori empties its water into Lake Victoria and so every time erosion occurs uh, the, the sand and the stuff that is swept goes downstream and all the way to the lake so you can imagine how many tons of soil have been eroded into Lake Victoria and how much space it is occupying into the lake that is our passion for planting trees at this riverbank as a means of controlling erosion to see that the trees hold back the soil uh, because if we continue uh, letting the soil go into the lake uh, in years to come in decades to come or in millenniums to come we could end up losing the entire lake it is our drive to see that uh, we protect 
and we conserve this river bank. So, as you can see here, we've planted so, so many trees at the river bank, and we've ensured that we leave it bushy, so that every time the river overflows, it does not sweep away uh, the soil. Instead, uh, this acts as a sieve. So, look at the beauty of River Migori. So, so beautiful. And when I stand by the banks, this is how it looks. So, so nice, so, so wonderful. And uh, it could be ideal for so much recreation. Yeah, I remember when I first planted these trees here, they used to be so small, they used to be so young, and they could not stand erosion. At one point, uh, at one point we almost lost them when, uh, when the river broke its banks. But we are lucky to have them here today, and they are so strong, so grown up. And they can withstand. Uh, they can withstand the river if the river overflows any time again. Among the trees that we've planted here, uh, this is called acacia. This type of acacia is very thorny, but so so beautiful. And uh, uh, and these are the many many trees that we are raising at the banks of River Migori. Uh, to ensure that we conserve this river bank. We would love to do more and more of bamboo. That's why you see this bamboo tree here. Bamboo is the best for controlling erosion at the banks of a river. So we've got this bamboo here. And we have just a couple of them. I remember in the year 20. 20 when I planted uh, several of them along the river bank, but uh, they didn't survive because the river broke its banks and swept most of the bamboo that I planted. Quite unfortunate. I lost about 20. I lost about 20 seedlings that were already so large, and these here are among the bamboo seedlings that we are, have already prepared. To uh, we prepared these bamboo seedlings so that we'll be planting them at the river bank. We would love to do much more of this. We would really love to do much more of this, but uh, somehow it's not yet within our capacity. So if capacity allows, all these seedlings here will be planted into the community to increase uh, population of trees, to increase tree cover for our republic, for Africa, for our county Migori, and guess what? Pamela is right here. <laughs> Welcome, Pamela. Thank you. Nice to see you. Thank you. Yeah, I was talking to the community. I was talking to our audience. I was trying to explain to them uh, why we are planting trees at the river bank. Okay. Maybe what do you have for them? Um, I think you've explained everything. Yes. I've just arrived. And um, I'm sure you've been able to show them whatever we have at this site of ours. Yeah. And um, no much to say now. Thank you. I only request <laughs> them to subscribe to, to our YouTube channel so that they can support us, they can support our business. Thank you. And uh, for those who've been able to do with this business with us, those who've been purchasing the seedlings from us, and we say thank you and welcome again. Thank you so much. That is all from Pamela. And I was just telling you that uh, this is the kind of work that our typical day entails doing all this stuff from morning to evening, from dawn to dusk. This is what we are involved in. I'm so, so grateful for the little information I've been able to share with you. I'm looking forward to sharing a lot more for now. Bye bye from us, uh, Joint Hands Green Life Trees. We look forward to interacting a lot more. Bye bye for now.